This is CR Droid, which is one of the most customizable custom homes ever and it's quite popular. The version is 9.6, beta version is what we have. They announced that they, they are releasing the beta version with the version 9.6 for just for one week, I think so, for the testing purposes. As you know, that June security patch was quite delayed and a lot of custom homes are actually skipping this month's security patch and they will provide you the July security patch based updates. But let's see, CR Droid is giving you beta updates. Maybe within a week they will give you the stable version but we have installed the beta update and which are the features available or missing we will talk about all of those things in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this one till the until the end here's the first change and which is actually i think so a lot of you know about this one is enhanced pin option which means whenever you enter any pin you'll be able to see that we have no animation except that back or the cross options but whenever you type any pin you can see there's no animation in that key if i move on to settings option here is the option called enhanced pin privacy which is actually inspired from android 14 beta and it's now available in pixie as well it's available in evolution xos also maybe some other custom homes will also bring you this feature and yes this is one of the things which is available in c android 9.6 Including that, if you move on to the other options like back gesture, unfortunately, it's not themed. In Evolution XOS, I found it was themed. It was looking like Android 14 style. Even in Pixie SOS, this thing was themed. But in C Android, this thing is not exactly like that. You can see the back switch or basically back arrow is just same like the previous update. So no major change here. Including that, those were some major things which I found available or not available. But as this is one of the most customizable custom homes, if you take a look at the battery stats, you'll be able to notice we have the battery usage from the last full charge and why I love this thing because this is AOSP style graph. If you use the Google page custom home, you have the Google style dashboard, Google style battery stats. And uh, to be very honest, I don't like that. I don't know why, but actually that doesn't look that good. You have some extra information in the battery section like design battery capacity or current battery capacity etc including that CR Red also supports those latest lock screen shortcut options and this is the ui which was actually introduced just two months ago as far as i know some custom homes adapted that already some did not CR Red is actually here by the way this is based on june security patch it is having those beta updates right now maybe it's not available for most of the devices but if it is available and if you want to install you can see in CR Red settings Almost every feature which was available previously is already present. So that's interesting, I think so, because when March security patch arrived, because that was QPR2 update, a lot of custom homes were skipping some of features for you. And maybe some features are not available here right now, but most of the features still exist. One of my favorite feature already include the reticle notification. And we also have some uh, parallel space options. We have this Google services option. Google services, you have the option called Google services to, I mean enable or disable what this is you can simply the disable the google pay services from your device if you use the c Android version by by default if your device has google apps pre-installed or maybe you have installed google apps manually you can disable those google services this could be for any reason but if you just want to the feature is available here not every customer supports that but c Android is one of those which supports including that one of my favorite feature is parallel space and by the way, this parallel space may be considered as app loaning in the upcoming time in upcoming future, because of course, Android 14 is officially giving you app cloning feature. As far as I know, through the leaks I found, and the thing might be changed, things might be changed. But yes, in just few days, maybe around a week, you might get the Android 14 beta 4, and the things might be changed there. But let's see what they will bring you. But for now, parallel space is already included in C Android, and it's available in some other custom rooms too. One of my favorite features also have retake notifications, and that's a great replacement of heads up notification that is already present i made already video regarding c Android settings i mean c Android customizations which are those great customizations which you should try and also i made some comparison videos of c Android versus evolution xos and maybe even project elixir versus evolution xos some custom some custom rooms comparison video i made already if you want to take a look at all those videos you can check out our channel and a lot of videos regarding custom rooms are already available make sure to subscribe the channel for more custom home videos and this is it from today's short and simple video hope you like this thanks for watching